This is a poem for weddings. It's called Wedding Poem for You. This poem contains the first time I ever saw you standing, smiling, sitting, or just talking, looking into the eyes of other people as you spoke, or staring into the distance as if you were searching for someone, or walking with purpose as if you were on your way to meet them. This poem remembers that I studied your ears for unsightly hair, and the profile of your nose for an unattractive bulbous end or excessive asymmetry. These were physical cautions that accompanied my observation of the size of your belly. If I could not get past that, there was no point in presenting myself. Also, your height and shoulder breadth. Would I have to defend you in a bar fight or could you take care of yourself? The smell of your feet and the brightness of your teeth would come later if you wanted me. And if you didn't believe that I was the most stunning woman you'd ever seen, the Lolita of your dreams in every respect, then I'd have simply thought you ignorant. Whereas now we're marrying, I know you are a man of superior intellect.